A police pursuit that spanned from Denver to Littleton ended with police shooting a man who they said had a gun. The incident started near South Old Boulevard and West Saratoga Avenue in Denver. It ended at Clement Park in Littleton. That's near Columbine High School. To be clear, this did not involve the school, but it did push the school into secure status as classes continued. Crime and justice reporter Matt Jablo has been following this case since it broke today. Matt, we know this started as a tip about a man with a gun. That's right, Alex. The call came in right around 11 o'clock this morning. Denver police say a man with a felony warrant was carrying a gun in West Denver. When officers arrived, they say they saw the man get into a car and take off, so they followed him. Denver Police Chief Ron Thomas says officers tracked the suspect to the intersection of Bowles and Pierce and Littleton. According to Thomas, when officers tried stopping the suspect, he got out of his car with what appeared to be a gun and started running into Clement Park with the officers right behind him. Thomas says officers tried taking the man down with non-lethal force, but it did not work. Ultimately, uh, lethal force uh, was used. The party uh, did go down. Officers attempted to re render some medical aid uh, and was able to secure that individual. The suspect, who has not yet been named, was taken to the hospital with what are believed to be non-life-threatening injuries. Chief Thomas says they recovered his gun here at the scene, but Chief Thomas has not said if he believes the suspect fired that gun at officers. Kim mm -hmm. and Alex. Well, anything like this catches our attention, but you look at the skate park behind you and all the ballparks nearby and a high school. It sure could have been a lot worse. All right, thank you, Matt.